Hi everyone, Release Fire here. So I'm going to talk you through how I eventually managed to take down the old growth boss here in control. It was a bit of a beast. I had to like set it all up, make sure I'd got all the like health in place. I'll talk you through all of that in a little second. Hopefully the video is going to help you out. If it does, drop me a like below. But essentially there's two things you need in terms of personal mods to give yourself a bit of an edge against the old growth boss. And the first of these is a bit of a shield boost, and the second is ideally you'd want two health boosts. So essentially I've got like 41% to 30%, so I've got like a 70% boost to my health, which you can see on my health bar. I've also got a bit of a boost to the pierce gun, which will uh, give me extra impact, extra damage, when I aim. Ideally you want as much damage as possible with uh, with pierce as you can. You can see this is the quickest way to go. If, you, uh, if you're struggling to get down to the boss on a regular basis just follow this route but then you just want to head on down here and this will take you into the main pit where you'll find Mold One. He's, uh, he's a tough boss even now even with my full setup but I've got my health maxed out and I've got like a bit of shield benefit. It still nearly took me out. So you can see it's definitely not gonna be an easy one to destroy, but I found this was the strategy that gave me a best chance. And the first thing is to use your shield whenever it's gonna do that move. And then you want to use the Pierce's charge shot to get it when it opens up. And you can see I'm taking quite a lot of damage off it. But one of the things that I did notice is that when it comes in for the head attack, it actually doesn't hurt you, so you get four hits on it in quick succession if you're kind of moving quickly. Now once you get past like maybe 30% of its health left, it just starts firing all of its missiles directly at you and you're going to need to use all of your shield to be able to make it through. And then just ideally try to get off a shot before it gets you with its last set of missiles and that should see you finishing it off. And like I said earlier, that's just the way I did it. I'm sure you could probably, you know, look for different ways, but I found that with the charge shot of Pierce and then using the shields and using all the setup to be able to give myself the edge, I was able to finish it off. I tried loads of different ways. I tried levitating and dodging and, and running around and picking up health, but that was the only way that I managed to get close. Like I said earlier, hopefully the video helps you out. If it does, drop me a like below. As ever, it's massively, massively appreciated. You can also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already with the links on the left-hand side and hit that bell button if you want to get notifications for all of my videos as they come out. You can see the rest of my series on control with the links on the right-hand side. Leave any comments below. Let me know how you get on against the old growth boss and I will catch you next time.